summer vacations, adventures, traveling. It's easy to get snap happy because there is so much to take photos of, but you may not have the time or photography knowledge to set up each shot perfectly. Here are six tips to fix some common issues with summer photos and to make them look professional. Before we get started, if you're watching this video on YouTube, you'll find a link in the description below that will take you to our tutorial page on the Discovery Center. Here you can download a written copy of this tutorial to follow along. Let's get started. It's important to get a good base photo before you start adjusting or adding effects. If your photo is crooked, it is noticed right away and really detracts from it. Luckily, it's super simple to straighten them in PaintShop Pro. Go to the toolbar on the left and select the Straighten tool. A straightening bar with end handles will pop up on the image. Now drag each handle of the straightening bar to align it with the part of the image that you want to straighten. I'm going to line up the straightening bar across the boardwalk in my photo. Then click on the check mark to apply the changes. And now you can see my peer view is nice and straight. Also to get a good base photo, you may want to crop out unwanted elements and to follow the basic rules of photo composition to create a nice balance. Select the crop tool from the toolbar, click on the presets icon and select the size you need. Here you can choose from a number of standard photo sizes but you can also select Freeform to crop the image and enter in your own custom width and height dimensions. For this image, I'm going to click on the 16 by 9 preset. Now I can drag the corner boxes to crop the image and the aspect ratio will be automatically maintained. We can also use the rule of thirds grid to help make our snapshot look even more professional. Horizons should align with the horizontal grid line and important objects or subjects at one of the horizontal or vertical intersections. For this image, I'm going to line where the sky begins along the upper horizontal line. Now I can click the green check to apply the crop to the current image, or select Crop as New Image to preserve my original image. We can use the Blemish Fixer to perfect skin, or even to remove some small unwanted objects. To open the Makeover tools, click the drop-down arrow next to the Red Eye tool. Then click Makeover. Now click on Blemish Fixer. Then adjust the brush size so that the blemish fits just inside the inner circle. Hover over the blemish, click, and you'll see how the blemish has been covered. We can also use Magic Fill to remove larger objects. I want to remove this garbage bin from my village street shot. Just use one of the selection tools, then click and drag to select the object you want to remove. Then click on Magic Fill, and now you'll see the bin has been removed and the snapshot looks nice and clean. A common issue with summer photos is the lighting. Glare from the harsh summer sun can make your photos look washed out or if it's a gloomy day or you're taking photos in the shade or evening, your photos can end up too dark. First click on Adjust, then click Smart Photo Fix. That might be all you need. You'll see how this village shot looks much crisper and lighter now. Alternatively, for photos that are a bit too dark like this one, you can click on Adjust, then Fill Flash and adjust the settings to your liking. Or you can try Adjust, then Brightness and Contrast, then Fill Light and Clarity, and make adjustments to make your photo brighter and crisper. For photos that are too light or washed out, we can click on Adjust, then Backlighting, and play around with these settings until we're happy with the result. There are lots of ways to adjust color in PaintShop Pro. Here are the two most common and easy methods. Click on Adjust, then White Balance to make the photo warmer or cooler. This isn't just for fixing color issues, but can also be used to alter the mood of an image. We can also click on Adjust, then Hue and Saturation, then Hue Saturation Lightness. From here, we can bump up the saturation level to make your photos more vibrant and colorful. Just don't go too far. 
PaintShop Pro has a wide variety of effects to choose from. Here are a few of our favorites. Go to Adjust, then Brightness and Contrast, and then Local Tone Mapping to create an effect similar to HDR. You can also try out Effects, then Illumination Effects, then Sunburst to add a lens flare and sunbeams or sunspots, which is perfect for summer photos. Finally, we can try out one of the instant effects by clicking on Palettes, then Instant Effects. From here, let's go to the Retro category and double-click on Retro Process 1 to give the image a soft green look to it. These are just a few of the many ways you can quickly touch up your summer photos before sharing them with your friends and family. If you're watching this video on YouTube, you'll find a link in the description below that will take you to our tutorial page on the Discovery Center. Here, you can download a written copy of this tutorial to follow along and find other helpful tutorials for PaintShop Pro.